If you use something every day of your life, it probably makes sense to think it through. I probably spend 80% of my time inside as I mainly work from home, but things change. And um, when I do go out and just get out of the game, there are a few things that have to come with me. Like everyone else, something that doesn't leave from my side that much is my phone. I currently have the iPhone 11 and I upgraded from an iPhone XR. I don't believe in upgrades for these things anymore, even though the newer iPhones with the square aesthetic are looking sexy as fuck. I find that phones pretty much stay the same, except for the normal wear and tear and loss in battery life. As you can see, I actually drop mine quite often. It has a black case to protect it and a tempered glass which is quite broken. I actually take two phones with me sometimes, because of work. During the work week or when going to the office, I take one phone to take work calls or reply to emails when I am not near the computer. Facing up, they look quite the same. So in order to distinguish them, I put a red ugly tape that helps me know which one is which. On the inside, my phone looks like this. If you want to copy it, I've made a video on how my phone is arranged. As you may have noticed, I wear glasses. They don't leave my side. Get it? Side? Glasses, they are in front of me? Never mind. I've been wearing them since I can remember. It was in the late years of my life that I actually embraced it. For many years, I considered doing surgery to just experience what it feels like not wearing glasses or being able to see as soon as you wake up. But that thought is slowly fading away. I want to say that it's because they become part of my identity, but in all honesty, it's because they're expensive as fuck. I have a sacred wallet, which looks cool. It has this button, I don't know how you name it. And you pull it up and all your cards come up. And it also has space for some coins, other cards and... Oh hey, look, money! Beside my glasses, my keys are something I always take with me. I had an old king chain, which was not helping with my pants and was actually making some holes in it. So instead, I bought this leather keychain, which helps to keep all the keys in one place. And it fits perfectly in my pocket. I also take a watch with me. I try not to look at the time from my phone and actually try to use it as little as I can. So I have my watch. I have two watches actually. One I got from my dad and then an Apple Watch. The Apple Watch is the one I use the most. Especially because it allows me to read messages and track stuff like my steps or sleep. Unfortunately, I need an upgrade. Because the screen cracked and the price of fixing the screen is more expensive than the watch itself. I like listening to music and sometimes not even listening to people talk, so I take my headphones. I can listen to podcasts and music, mainly podcasts I have to admit. I have the AirPods Pro, I've been having them for a couple of years and honestly the sound is amazing. The noise cancelling and bass in this thing is pretty good for its size, totally recommend. Especially if you want to block sounds from the street. I drink quite some water, so something I take with me at all times is a bottle of water, whichever I can find at home. I've been digging one I got from work, which looks simple and it keeps my drinks cold or warm, whichever it needs to be. Not much to say, it's just a bottle, keeps you hydrated. So yeah, those are the things I take with me when I go out. Oh shit, I'm going to work, sorry, please subscribe.